Hey there guys, welcome back. My name's Stuart and today we've got a very special episode for you. It's the first ever episode of the joy of RCTing and I'm going to be painting a beautiful landscape for you as my way of saying thank you to all the thousand plus people who have subscribed to the channel. So I'm going to go, go I'm going to start off with a nice 50 by 50 canvas. I'm going to plonk my little brush down there and I'm going to press, I'm going to make it smaller. I'm going to turn it into the mounting tool. And all we're going to do is we're going to just, just pop it down anywhere. And we're just going to press raise, just create a nice, a nice big mountain. And, and you know, mountains, they shouldn't be on their own. They all need a nice friend. So let's just add a few more mountains. Hell, why not even make a mountain party? There's no, nothing worse than a, than a sad little mountain on his own. Everyone needs a friend. Let's add some mountains. And and the best thing about adding lots of mountains is you also create little valleys as well. Every mountain needs a valley. Every valley needs a mountain. Maybe some little hills just down here. And there you go. Nice. Lovely little mountain scene. Okay. And now what we're going to do, we're going to continue using the mountain tool. We're just going to plonk it down here on the other side of the map and we're going to go down this time. Just down like that, just just random, just random. Just lower in the ground. Along the, somewhere along the screen I'll try and put some of the colours that we'll be using on this landscape and hopefully maybe maybe some of you after we're finished maybe you could pause pause the video and hang your screen up in your living room or something and then maybe a family would come home and say why why are you hanging that monitor on the side of the wall and, and they'd be like oh Stuart painted the picture and we just just wanted to show it off to the family there you go just add in few little just random doesn't, doesn't matter there you go I think there you go I think we're done with the mountain brush now so I'm going to clean this mountain brush off I love doing this there you go, it should be nice and clean and uh, I think what we'll do now is we'll go in we'll use a bigger brush, we'll use a, a 7x7 brush and then I think what we'll do is we'll use we'll use the ice ice brush and what we'll do is we'll come onto the mountains and if we zoom in we can either click there and, and click change or we can just give it a double tap it's easier if you've got it zoomed in because you're double tapping in the same spot. If you if you've got it zoomed out, it's it's harder to get it in the same in the same spot. There you go. Just just double tap in. What we could do is we could change change that as well so that when we've got some some jagged rocks, we're changing them too. Color them in. Just coloring in. I think that's enough. I think I think these mountains have probably gone a bit too far. I could probably change those. We won't have all of those with the snow and ice. These ones just down here. We can change. We can just make them a bit. Maybe some rocks at the top. We can go over them. There, just like that. Just like that. 
There's nothing that you do that you can't fix or ch can't change later. There you go. There's no such thing as mistakes. There's only happy accidents. Okay, so we're going to go into the dirty tool now. And what we're going to do is make it a bit, a little bit smaller. I think what we're going to do is we're just going to... Just change large areas. You can always use a smaller brush later on to make it look less, less uniform and more random. I think we're going to need to go back onto the smaller ice brush just to add a little bit of randomness just up here look at that snow wonderful everyone would like to go and I'll take a walk through these hills maybe a sled, build a snowman shoot, it doesn't have to be a snowman Maybe some of these, some of these bits, just down here, where they're slightly ragged. Maybe we could, we could either tidy them up, or, or we could just make them a bit, 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 bit of a rock effect. Add a few more. And I think what we'll do now, we'll use some sand. Just colouring in the sand, just colouring in this area here. Just putting down some sand. In real life this would have taken millions of years to get all this sand down there. But on this we can just do it in a matter of minutes. A little bit of sand. Maybe I should have done the rock after the sand. So I'm going to have to go back in and just touch that up a little. Just add a few bits. Just bit, bits at random. And maybe some darker sand as well. Some dirt. Just to add a little bit of contrast. Okay, now for the fun bit, we're gonna get the water and we're gonna start. Let's raise it up. This is gonna be a beach and a sea.
So now we've done the sand. Let's let's do some fine tuning on the on the grass just down here. And we can go over. Go over with the sand. So now let's just add a little bit of sand, just a little bit of randomness. This is your world. You can do it any way you like. Just use your imagination. Or, if you're lucky enough to have been any places like this, just try and try and draw it from memory. Okay, so I think now we're ready to add some trees in. So I'm going to start off with some snow trees, and I'm going to use the tree spamming brush, and then we can just we can just plonk some down, and then maybe some of these ones. A little bit of variation, and then we can come in. How about that? If we add too many or we add them in places that we don't quite want them, we can always delete them later. We can always perform a treeectomy. Let's have a look. Try and, try and, uh, let's try and get some with slightly different colors. Okay, so now I'm just gonna just gonna delete some of the ones where they're in maybe the wrong place or maybe there's too many of them. a few final touches just to get the edge And there we have it. Beautiful landscape painted for each and every one of my beautiful subscribers. Hope you enjoyed this very special episode of The Joy of RCTN. And I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>